The Gauteng MEC for Community Safety, Faith Mazibugo, led a nighttime march through the streets of Sunnyside in Pretoria under the banner Reclaiming the Streets. Sunnyside is popular for its vibrant nightlife, entertainment and red light districts. Gender-based violence and other violent crimes are, however, a daily occurrence, as Lindogutle Lala reports. Several civil society groups also took part in the march. Scores of women and men united in their desire for a crime-free city. No means no, they shouted, demanding an end to gender-based violence and other crimes. The march follows many others around the country, highlighting the scourge of GPV. Enough is enough. Perpetrators need to be dealt with harshly. All those that know are abusing our young women when they walk here in the night, they must know that today is not happening. We want a free and safe sunny side today, but only not ending today. They call that police must always be visible and ensure that our communities are safe is another message that we're putting across. Public servants also added their voice to the nationwide outcry over the sketch of gender-based violence, which has been thrust in the spotlight with the growing number of cases. The match also saw SAPS and Tswane Metro Police officers under the banner reclaiming the night, taking a firm stance, with some of the marchers calling for security forces to be beefed up in the area. Police will never be enough. Uh, we need Sunnyside. It's, it's a densely populated area. And I think the size of the population needs as much manpower. Another concern is your police patrollers. The patrolling vehicles are not enough. The unusual after hours march was a clear indication that society is standing up to the criminals finally. Police kept a watchful eye on the proceedings. Lindogu Zaza, SAPC News, Sunnyside in Pretoria.